following the Cassie lawsuit, Janet Jackson and Naomi Campbell take down Diddy's picture. In the aftermath of Sean Diddy Combs' highly publicized lawsuit, in which Cassie, his ex-girlfriend, says he was involved in sex trafficking and abuse, among other things, it appears that two of his most well-known friends are pulling away from him. Last week, Jackson and Campbell joined Diddy for a party at Lavo in London to commemorate his 54th birthday and the release of his most recent album. They both shared pictures from the party on Instagram to chronicle their fun. However, the model and singer had deleted their posts by Friday. The move came after Cassie claimed in a shocking lawsuit filed on Thursday that Diddy had sexually assaulted her, physically and mentally mistreated her, and engaged in sex trafficking by forcing her to have sex with male prostitutes while he watched. Representatives for Jackson and Campbell did not respond to our inquiries. Diddy vehemently denies her allegations, according to his lawyer Ben Braffman, adding, MS. Ventura has been subjecting Mr. Combs to her persistent demand of $30 million, under the threat of writing a damaging book about their relationship, for the past six months. Meanwhile, the hip-hop mogul reportedly offered eight figures to silence her and prevent the filing of this lawsuit, according to Cassie's lawyer Douglas Wigdor who spoke with Page Six. She rejected his efforts, he continued. After the New York Times reported Cassie's allegations, Aubrey O'Day, another well-known Diddy protege who participated in the band Danity Kane and performed on his reality show Making the Band, has been apologizing on social media.